Hi, my name is Bernard Furlong. I'm the consultant vet with Grassland Agro. We're here today to discuss selective dry cow therapy. In line with new EU legislation, we need to identify the cows that require antibiotics and the cows that don't. The use of antibiotics as prevention medicine will no longer be permitted. It's more important now than ever to dry cows off as correctly as possible. Cows are five to seven times more likely to pick up a case of mastitis a week after drying off compared to any other stage throughout their lactation. This video is going to demonstrate now the recommended way in drying off dairy cows. Two of the most important factors when drying off cows would be sterility and preparation. Making sure you're prepared, having enough help at hand and having all the individual items laid out in front of you. Secondly, sterility. Making sure you're as hygienic as possible. That's including your coat, your hands, your arms, the cow and everything in between. The aim is to shut down milk secretion and seal the teeth canal as rapidly as possible. The sealing usually takes over one week. Research has shown that virtually all new teeth infections occur in quarters where the teeth canal has not naturally sealed. T-Hex Dry provides a physical antibacterial barrier, giving environmental protection to the teeth during this period. The product can be used at drying off and again at pre-calving. In both cases, the product is used as a final step after the teeth is cleaned and after antibiotic infusion or internal teeth sealant. Prior to drying off, lay out all your equipment at hand. That would include your antibiotic tubes, your internal teeth sealant, head torch, and the T-Hex Dry Cow Pack, which contains T-Hex Dry and Dipping Cup, 400 cotton pads, methylated spirits, and plastic container. This is a complete Dry Cow Pack for 90 cows, to be used in conjunction with the Dry Cow tubes and or internal teeth sealant. Soak the cotton pads provided in the methylated spirits in the plastic container. Also pour out the correct amount of T-Hex, allowing for at least 10 mils per cow into the dipping cup. Disinfect the teats and dry with disposable paper towels. Use the cotton pads provided soaked in methylated spirits to fully sterilize the teeth. Insert antibiotics as recommended by the manufacturers. Disinfect the teats again with cotton pads and methylated spirits. After that, you can insert internal teeth sealer. Dip the teats in T-Hex, allowing for any drips to fall back into the container provided. Allow cows to stand for five minutes to allow the T-Hex to form a unique barrier on the teats. After drying off the cows, don't leave them onto roadways or dirty yards immediately. Avoid allowing them to lie down on bare ground or areas that are soiled with manure for at least two hours immediately after drying off. Put the cows in a clean dry paddock for three to four days. If cows are being housed directly after drying off, ensure that the cows have access to clean dry cubicles. This house should ideally be well away from the milking herd and milking area, so they don't have that stimulus to let down milk. If you'd like to learn more about the T-Hex Dry Cow Pack, please feel free to contact your local co-op, merchant or grassland agro representative.